you're not new, hopefully. Hopefully you know what I'm doing and I am doing it right. We have uh, the 6th of, the 20, 20th of May turn, it's the 6th turn. And uh, what we're trying to do in here is do the exploitation phase. And I've got a canal behind this stack right there. And what we're going to do is uh, uh, overrun this guy by going f uh, 4 to there plus 3 is uh, 7. And then I'm going to uh, 1, 4 to there. That's 5 plus 3 is uh, 8. And keep these guys in combat mode. And that will help us bust open, finally, a more substantial break in the line down here. It's been a real slog, and as you can see, I've got lots of DG units floating around that I've had to pull back off the line. Uh, the French have been using their artillery very effectively. So it's been uh, educational. I also have... Uh, well, we'll talk about that in a minute. I'll, uh, uh, we'll talk about supply in a second, because I had been making a mistake, but... I think fortunately it hasn't made too much of a dramatic error. So I will go run these combats and then come back. All right, we're back. Yeah, so we ran these combats real quick, and as I, <clears throat> after I ran these, I realized that in order to pay for them, you pay the point of combat, which is going to be in that uh, hex right below the, uh, let me just hold the phone, uh, here and here. And they are not going to be able to pull supply um, because I don't have enough supply set back here. Or well, maybe I do. Actually, you know what? Here's three supply. Never mind. They're not going to be low ammo. Uh, one thing I had been doing incorrectly with supply is uh, counting back and forward using the headquarter, headquarters uh, throw range. And it's only forward that you throw, not counting back. It's just five hexes, or five movement points, I should say, truck movement points back to a supply dump or a railhead for trace. So that was a, a, an error, and I've done it the same for both sides, and I've gone back and kind of, you know, had a look at the turn, the different turns through video, and it's not been a dramatic uh, problem, mainly because the terrain's so tight anyway that I've kept the uh, HQs pretty close together. And the other thing is, uh, I realized, I keep forgetting, uh, is that uh, headquarters can only throw in combat mode, I believe, and I need to reconfirm that, but that seems to be the case as well. So that means you've got to kind of leapfrog these HQs through the combats. All right, the second combat uh, was pretty devastating because we had a total of 42 factors since all the mech and the armor are doubled. And uh, there was always no chance of taking a loss there, but we did uh, inflict two losses on this stack. So we'll, uh, we'll wipe these two guys, and uh, the other fellow's got to retreat three. So we'll take it from there. 